Okay, this video is specifically to show you how to connect with everyone that you want to connect with. And I'm just going to skip straight to what I consider an advanced feature. But the reason I'm showing you this video is because I have connected with so many people and worked LinkedIn without paying premium. When I finish this video and today, I'm going to be upgrading to premium, but I want to show you how to search. If you have a free LinkedIn account, you do not want to pay for premium and you can still reach just as many people. The only, th there are a lot of features in premium, so I'm not even going to go into them because I've let, literally run my entire business and reached out to people without having it, but I am going to be signing up for premium, um, but you don't have to. So anyway, this is all about connecting with people. and so. There's one thing that I, I want to recommend. Okay, so basically just start at the search bar. Start at the search bar. <clears throat> and it's real simple because it's right here at the top, you know, when I, when I just click this. I mean, here's the thing with LinkedIn. You only have like five choices. One, two, three, eight, four, five, six choices. You either can search by people, jobs, content. I'm going to show you how to do that easy companies, schools, or groups. But let's just say you know exactly who you want. So I know who I want. I want to reach, I want to reach real estate brokers, but I, sometimes people don't label themselves as real estate broker. So I want to introduce something called the Boolean search, which you can just Google that. It's basically meaning that it's the same as Google. You can search using the and the or, or you put quotes around something, or you can even use the word site. I'll, that's a, an advanced thing. I'm going to show you how to, I'm going to do a separate video on how to use the Boolean search in Google to, to, you will be amazed what you can find. I was blown away how you're basically searching equivalent to the Google algorithm themselves using some of these Boolean searches on google.com. But in LinkedIn, they still allow you to do quotes, um, the word and the word or, the word site, S-I-T-E, or a dollar sign. So what I mean is I want to know, um, I want to find all the real estate broker, real estate broker, and, okay, just space and business owner. Because some people just label themselves as a business owner and they put some out, something else. Um, and then I'm just going to search. There's literally enough connections that you don't need to get all crazy in your hyper focus craziness. Um, once you have the words real estate broker and business owner, that's mine. You could put in anything like network engineer and administrator, just in case they're like, you know, labeled as both. And I want to, um, specify it as a job and I want actually I want it as people sorry and I want it all three connections because if you didn't know most of the, your connections actually come through the second and third connections so anything you post typically will reach the second and third connections more than anything um, Locations, I'm going to stick to U.S. And I'm not going to do a current company because I will take any company. 120,313 results. But if you are wanting to meet people in person, then I would say um, Virginia. And when you do Virginia, you really need to specify where, so you can't just like do that. So I would say Northern Virginia. I will say Alexandria. Um, 
me just experiment here. I'm just experimenting along with you guys because you just you need to find the right people. And that narrowed the search. That didn't actually. Uh, hmm. That's not good. We'll do a narrowed search after we choose US. The thing is with me is that I want to reach brokers outside of Virginia. And do you see how some of them are just like business owner, business owner, real estate investor? I mean, I want those people. So this is why I did like both. Um, commercial real estate, principal broker. So I wouldn't have got him if I put real estate broker and just a business owner. And I will literally connect, 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 connect. So when I do that, I want to, I'm going to go into how to convert, two ways to convert, two simple little messages to convert. But when you're connecting, um, always, always, always send a personal note. And the reason I'm not going to do this right this second is because, um, well, I could do it, but I don't have anything to cut and paste at this second. But in part of my next video, which is titled Converting Clients After You Connect, um, here's the fact. People don't like to be spammed. And everyone prefers to do business with people they know and trust. So cold outreach on LinkedIn needs to be strategic. So you're not seen as like business spammy. So when you connect with someone and they're not necessarily like a first contact or whatever, you only have 300 characters to say something. If you just press connect, most likely people, I mean, it depends on how active they are. They're either going to just accept you, but then they're going to be like, why? So um, for me, I would say, let me just go off this a second. She's a real estate broker business owner. And I go straight for the no nonsense. I literally write something like, um, hold on a second. <laughs> Let me look at her thing. Carmen. I would literally write something like, hi, Carmen. I noticed that we're both based in the Washington DC area. And if you're open to it, I'd love to invite you to do an unconventional coffee with me. That is a live stream promo of your business. And in that people will learn what you do and what makes you unique in the business. This is one way I do it. So, you know, I might do that if she, and you just see how they respond. The alternative, which I'm just going to go ahead and keep this video, both connecting and converting. Um, the, the alternative would be to set up a phone call with someone. And the reason someone would set up a phone call is if you first give them value. So, you know what, for this one, um, I'm going to go ahead and I don't have this copied, but I'm just going to type it. I'd love to invite you to do an unconventional copy, which of course people will be weirded out by that. So they need to know exactly what that is. A live stream of 30 minutes or less. Sometimes people only want to give you 10 minutes of their time, which is totally fine. Um, of your business and in that, People will learn what you do. This is like, no one does this. No one sends this kind of stuff. So this is like going to be very unique for her. Uh, I've maxed out my, my characters. That's why I wanted to pre-do this. But anyway, um, Let me copy that. And 
that's basically it. We'll see how that's received. <laughs> and so the other way you would connect with people. Let's say this guy, Winston Thomas, real estate broker, investor. Um, or let me just go and scroll down here to commercial real estate principal broker. These people need help. So basically what I'm saying is always, always, always add a note. Never just try to connect. Do not press the send invitation button until you write something out. Now this one will be a little longer. This is my strategy number two. Strategy number two basically is going to link them directly to my calendar that, and where I use schedule that's schedule once to set up my auto calendar. And what I say there is, let's say, uh, what's this person's name? Uh, Mona. So in this case, I would say, hi, Mona. Thanks for connecting with me. And, or I would say, thanks, Mona. Thanks for, thanks. Thank you in advance for connecting with me. I noticed that your company recently, I, I would probably pick, what I like to pick is something you can easily find, which is how long they've been with their current company. I, re, I noticed your company recently passed the three-year mark of being open and prospering, and you must be very busy scaling your real estate brokerage to the next level. I will shorten this. I thought you might be interested in a case study. We wrote, we just wrote about how we helped a brokerage grow fast using online marketing and Facebook ads. The title is how we receive 90% conversion rate on our real estate agent recruiting funnels. If you have time, I would love to set up a call to learn about your office. How does your calendar look next week? I will just lay it out. And then when they connect with you and accept you, you basically can send a calendar scheduling link or you can stick the calendar scheduling link just at the bottom. So I, that what I just read, what I just said, needs to be shortened and then I will send her that. So I'm not gonna send it right this second, but I'm gonna give you samples in another presentation. So basically you're either connecting to get in person, which I don't like to do the in person, I like to do via live stream, or you're connecting to get a call. And so you need to give them some value, which is why I mentioned the case study, so that you can first say, hey, I'm, the, I'm this person and I noticed something about you and here's a case study that shows your kind of business and how I grow it. Check it out. And if you're interested, let's hop on a call. And that's kind of what that's about. So I just convert, I just can, I just used both connect and convert. The thing is, I think we make it difficult. We're like, I don't know who to search. I don't know what to do. And it's like, all you gotta do is like with a free account even, just start doing this. Obviously there's like a more detailed, way to search with the advanced LinkedIn, but if you don't want to pay for it, you can find just as many people, endless amounts of people to connect with and get business from without it. So um, I will do a premium LinkedIn search as soon as I upgrade tonight, and then I'll send that to you guys.